pliers. There are many types of pliers. So this is a common size or common type of pliers. It just opens and closes on the jaw. And it has two settings where you can make it just a little bit wider. Then you have what's called needle nose pliers. They simply come to a point at the fronts in order to get into tight areas. And these actually come with a small cutter in there for thin wires, but they're pretty much useless. And they come in all kinds of sizes. Here's another type of pliers meant to just cut thin wire. Next, you come to it, your adjustable pliers. And these are called channel locks. And that's because, if you look on this side, there are different channels right here that you can lock this into to get larger sizes. Much larger than you can get on this right here. And then here it is a very large size for channel locks. You actually have to push this button in in order to move these. These are specialty pliers called linesman pliers. These are for electrical use. They allow you to twist the wires um, when you're putting them together and they have cutters in them right here. So these are much better for electricians than a regular pair of pliers. And these are called nips. Basically, you take the cutting edge of this pair of pliers and you put it out on the end where it comes together in order to cut small nails or wires. And finally, we have what's called vice grip pliers. So these have a turning mechanism on the end that opens and closes this, not a channel. Kids confuse these all the time. Vice grips are great because they can actually lock onto something. So if you adjust it, I can lock it down onto this other pair of pliers. And it will stay there. That's why they're called vice grips, because a vice will hold things together, where channel locks will not stay on. In order to remove these, it's a little lever right there, you just simply squeeze these two together and it pops off.